Hi guys, we'll be checking out the XCOM Enemy Unknown demo just came out today on Steam. So if you're not going to check it out, do that. But first of all, watch this video because I'm going to have a quick playthrough of the demo and see what I think of it. I've heard a look, I've heard a little bit about the game, but not tons and tons of coverage. But the stuff I've seen does look potentially pretty fun and quite uh, addictive. Um, so obviously you're like a sort of commander dude that sort of takes control of these soldiers against that weird looking alien thing that's walked past. Anyway, I'm going to start the demo now. In light of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Good luck, Commander. That was the last transmission, sir. Patch me through to Voodoo 3-1. Alright, so let's go and save Germany from the alien threat. Uh, well, it's unknown at the moment, but as you can probably guess, it's some sort of alien life form that's wanted us to take over. Central, this is Big Sky. Looks like we found the crash site. Roger, Voodoo 3 1. Any sign of activity? Negative. Nothing's moving down there. Okay. Set her down nearby.
Central. You getting all this? Copy that, Delta Squad. First things first. Let's get you out of the open and into cover. Whatever did this could still be out there. Delta One, take point. Let's do this. Take cover behind that debris directly in front of you. Um, oh, that one. Okay, so I guess this is us getting used to the controls. Um, you left click and then right click. So actually do like a movement. The subject can move up to two times per turn. The number of remaining moves is indicated on the soldier's unit flag. Good. Now advance to the vehicle nearby. Good. Right, so we left click. Or not. There we go. So that's our second Delta move. Two. Your turn. Move up to the debris. Delta two. Go, 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 go. That thing isn't going to offer you much cover, but it's better than nothing. There's full cover straight ahead. Advance to that position. Delta 3, move to that vehicle dead ahead. Central, I have movement. 30 meters north of my position. Police vehicle. Roger. Proceed to the next vehicle for a better vantage point. Let's get indicated sometimes. Hello. There we go. Run, run, run. Let's get a better vantage point. Go check it out. It's a long way from your position, and there's no available cover between here and there. So you better double time. That's it. Oh yeah, a bit of running animation. Japanese lady. Holy hell. What do you see, Delta? What the hell? Report. Is that like some sort of weird zombie thing? Looks like one of the recon teams, sir. It looks like something. <laughs> Is that your man, Delta Four? Negative, sir. That's someone else. <laughs> Dr. Valen, what's he saying? He is saying, help me. That radio transmission is coming from somewhere north of the squad's current position. Based on its strength, probably from inside a structure. Thank you, Doctor. Delta, advance and infiltrate that building. And remember, stay in cover. Let's right, stay in cover. This will get tricky. Could there be some alien life form in this building? I'm guessing there will be. Let's move forward here. Double time, double time! Central, I got a yes. lot of blood here. Oh god. Let's see it. See where it's this from. Bus shelter thing. Oh, we can get inside it. Central, I think I just found hell? another one of the recon team. Or oh, what's left of him. But this doesn't make sense. Looks like he's been dead for a week. Even more perplexing is the cause of death. It appears that he was eviscerated when something burst out of him from the inside. Oh God. Sir, I have visual on the object. Permission to approach. It's the only cover between you and that building. Permission granted. That's that object isn't a very safe though. What is it? I got no idea what this thing is. But I can confirm that it's no satellite. Roger. Thank you for the info, right, bro. Squad. We're almost to the building. Keep moving. Let's keep moving there. That's a long run. Just dashing it. Okay, people. Now let's get inside. Delta One, there's a window in front of you. Let's take a look. In position. Looks clear. Get through here. Copy that. Sorry, all you need to do is right click. And get to cover. Oh, nice animation there through Delta the window. Two. That door's in our way. Take it down. Take it down, bitch. Smash the door in. I guess you just right click when you want to move. Sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. Now the door's smashed. This door can just walk straight through it. Central, we have eyes on the target. He's armed. Copy Delta 3. Okay, everyone. Get into position nearby, but do not approach. Doctor, see if you can communicate with him. Tell him to drop his weapon. I will try. Hello. Können Sie mich hören? Wir sind hier, um Ihnen zu helfen. Bitte lassen Sie Ihre Waffen fallen. He appears to be in shock. Keep your eyes open, people. Appears to be like in shock. Doesn't really help anyone, does it? 
I'm in shock. Move in and disarm him. Carefully. Good on the Let's investigate. It doesn't sound very wise. He's just got a grenade in his hand. He's ready to blow up. Leave your gun out. Hold your gun up against him. Ah. God. It's like his eyes. Oh, Jesus. What the? There's one guy down already. He definitely did. There's one there. Nope. Oh, what? Down. Delta one is down. There's two swabbems already. Is that my mistake or is this just a tutorial? We're fire from She's suppressed. This She's down. Down, mm. One guy left, I think. Damn it. Delta two, your flank two. Find some better cover. Let's do this. All right, Delta Two. Weapons free. Get ready. Space to bar. Get space bar again. Uh, what have I done? Not my fire. There you go. Oh, you're on face. There's a green goo everywhere. Mm. Nice shot. Delta four, you're freed up to move. Get out of there and get into cover. Uh, can't be somewhere else. So we'll something together. Oh well. Now toss your grenade at the enemy in front of you. Let's activate the grenade. Let's check it here. Oh yeah, bounce. Oh, right on his face. Ready for their no chance. Oh, here comes one. Look out, Delta Four. There's another one coming in behind you. No! Oh, not another one. Damn it. It's Jesus. Just now, There's three squad members in one mission. Tip the odds in our favor. Look around for a position where you can flank the enemy. What? That's it. You have a clear shot from that position. Fire. Fire, fire. I want to fire. Okay. Close. Okay. There we go. Oh yeah, two alien scums down. Or was it three? Phew. Central, I think that's it. It's over. Roger that, Delta. Secure the bodies and head back to the Sky Ranger for immediate extraction. Lag. Um, identity identify base location North America or Europe. I live in Europe, so I'll do that for now. Um, okay, so it changes all aircrafts and aircraft weapons cost 50% less to produce, laboratories and workshops cost 50% less to build and maintain. We go for Europe. We are coming home. European is our base. nearly took out a squad of our best soldiers. If you'll excuse me, doctors, the commander is waiting in mission control. Their technology is far beyond ours. Then I'd say our work is cut out for us, doctor. Welcome to XCOM HQ, commander. Yeah. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold. Providing tactical support for our field operations and keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Wow. 
That's quite impressive. I love this base. I'm not like a Manda dude. Um, Commander to the barracks. Let's go to the barracks. The soldier is waiting for you in the armory, which is located there in the barracks. Oh, that's the guy that survived the quink from Delta Squad made it back alive from our last mission, Commander. And I'd say a promotion is in order. Sounds good. As you know, Commander, every soldier is different. This particular soldier has shown an aptitude for heavy weapons. As he gains additional combat experience, we should continue his training along these lines. What training in rocket? This soldier will now nice. carry a rocket launcher in addition to his standard weapon. The aliens won't know what hit him. Oh, Dr. Volan asked to see you in the research labs, Commander. It sounded important. Commander to the research labs. Hello, Commander. My name is Dr. Farlan. I oversee the research labs. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. We have already begun analyzing the artifacts recovered from our first encounter with the aliens. Based on our preliminary findings, we believe we can use them to develop some new equipment for our soldiers. With your approval, we will begin research immediately. Right, so this is where we choose potential upgrades for our units. Um, so this one we don't seem to have enough, so we'll ignore it for now. These fragments are all the remains of the powerful alien weaponry we've encountered so far. Further study could lead to advances in our own weapons and development programs. The alien pills have materials that are lighter, stronger than anything we've seen before. Right, so they just want to investigate lower materials. Um, go for... Just investigate that, it sounds a bit more interesting. Thank you, Commander. This research will take some time. We will notify you once it is complete. Want it now. Commander to mission control. Commander to It sounds control. like you are needed elsewhere. Farewell, Commander. If you recover any additional artifacts during your field operations, I would be quite eager to study them. Commander to mission control. Right. Mission control. The enemy is testing our capabilities, Commander. We've gotten reports of simultaneous attacks in two different countries. We can only respond to one. The country we help will donate more resources to our cause. But the panic level of the country we choose not to help will rise. It's not an easy decision, Commander, but it's one you'll have to make. All right. Um, so we view, view it? So what's the... Oh, so US. San Francisco or Shanghai, China. For me, that's quite an easy decision. <laughs> Overboard for scientists. Um, that would get some money. And they're both classes easy. So I think we'll go for the US, obviously, because. Yeah. <laughs> Understood. The troops are waiting for you in the hangar. Before deploying our squad, you can choose which soldiers to send out there. I've taken the liberty of calling up our veteran. His combat experience makes him invaluable on the battlefield. Right, so those are our next men. We've got to. Hopefully, they won't die this time. I'm guessing that the longer we keep the soldier, the more they rank up, the more sort of serious they get, the more powers they get, better guns they get, and potentially really, really cool. I think this game's got a lot of potential. I wasn't expecting to really enjoy it that much, but. I enjoyed it very, very much, and I think it could be potentially a very cool tactical game that's going to be a lot of fun and a really cool story. So, yeah, if you want to see more of the demo, make sure you press that like button, let me know in the comments, and thanks for watching this video, and I'll like to see you again soon, so make sure you subscribe, and come back soon. Thanks for watching.